While the balance of the presidency rests in the hands of the battleground states, people here at home are demanding a fair election. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Shantae Passmore is following the growing calls right now to allow the election process to continue without interference. It could be days before America knows who will be the next president, and that's because key battleground states are still tallying votes. From the steps of the Connecticut state capitol, people are shouting, count every vote. Defending democracy. Are we going to make sure that every vote is counted? It's Let's a vow made by each person in the crowd to President Donald Trump. I say to you with great respect, let us count every damn vote in our country. The theory follows after the president announced he won the 2020 election early Wednesday morning, while a massive ballot count is in motion. In states like Pennsylvania, election officials say they've almost counted half of the mail-in ballots as of before noon. Here in Connecticut, voters say they're demanding the president honor the election process. I think we just have to make clear that the will of the people is the will of the people. At the end of the day, we all want the same thing, which is just have a fair election. A who's who of Connecticut's local and state leaders appeared during this rally called Count Every Vote, which is also being held nationwide. State Attorney General William Tong told the crowd a bipartisan group of former and current attorney generals and governors are working to ensure each vote is accounted for. Meanwhile, other speakers said they'll continue to stay visible. We will demand this and we will keep demanding it until we get it. In Hartford, it's an important way to stop them. Shante Passmore is for us to be in these streets. Channel 3 Eyewitness News.